Hey shooters. This is the bench video for the Nix. So the Nix is our mid-size um, Glock 19 uh, size four and a quarter carry gun, uh, often known in the 1911 world as a commander. Uh, comes in three colors, all black, which we don't have here today with this, but with the uh, controls black. Um, hard chrome, which is hard chrome frame and slide, black everything else. And then this gun, which is two-tone. So uh, black grip frame slide and stainless uh, controls, polished barrel stainless. So three color variations, uh, which are is a standard on uh, all the Atlas guns. It's got slide lightning and caulking serrations um, that are that are unique to the, the Nix. They do not go all the way through. That's so we can keep lint and dirt uh, and debris off of the barrel. All of them come standard with a tack rail. You can order them without a tack rail. They all come with a four and a quarter inch barrel. They all get flush cut barrels with a reverse crown. They all run at a, uh, the short um, toolless guide rod, which is actually a 4.15. It's a tad shorter than the barrel, um, so it gives it a unique look up front. All, all the finishes come in a matte finish. Uh, polished finish is a custom shop option. They all have the new alpha grip, so we have the adjustable grip panels in here. Uh, you can run them smooth like these, or we call these flat actually, uh, or you can adjust them as needed. This is the alpha grip in what we call carry. So it's the diamond uh, delta pattern that we run on all the 9mm guns, but with all the little, the CNC machine, the 5-axis machine actually breaks all the little edges. Um, so it's very grippy, but it will not tear your shirts up like the uh, moderate grip, which is the same pattern with all the edges on the triangles left sharp. Uh, of course, we have the Gephardt trigger system. You can choose your trigger color and length. As always, you get the, the amazing Atlas trigger. The way that we do the triggers on these guns is we set the trigger for uh, one and three quarter pounds, and then uh, you always have the option of getting the triggers like that, but if you want a carry trigger, we just turn up the spring, but if you ever wanted to um, you know, adjust it back down. The geometry will work for that. It has a 140 fiber front sight as standard. It has an Atlas carry uh, rear sight with the ledge so that if you needed a rack off a belt or a shirt, you can do that. We run about a 10 pound spring in there. That's all part of the toolless guide rod system. Uh, a little bit different from previous generations, you have to have a magwell with the alpha um, grip system with the stand with the pan that actually pins the panels in in the bottom. And so we came out with this very small uh, IDPA and IPSC legal magwell, but also very nice for carry as it has a super low profile. There's talk potentially of a trim ring coming in the future that'll just be a ring here much smaller even than the magwell. So all the features you need and none of the features you don't. The coolest part about these guns, and you'll see that on the live fire video that's coming, the the return to zero is, is not as good on a 4.25 gun as a 4.6 inch gun. It requires more grip pressure to keep the muzzle down. But with, um, so I say with a 4.6 inch gun, you need a medium firm grip pressure. With a strong, um, you know, the strong plus grip pressure, these guns have a perfect zero return. It just requires more grip pressure, right? So the faster we get the slide speed and the, more, the snappier it gets, the more I need to hold that platform to get the gun to come back down to zero. What will happen if you use a medium grip pressure with this gun is it will lift and it won't come all the way back. So we're we're actually keeping the gun from lifting as much by having a, a firm grip pressure. But if you're an accomplished shooter with a firm grip pressure, um, this gun will do perfect zero with a firm, uh, you know, a, a, a strong to strong plus, let's say. Uh, very, very firm grip pressure. If not, the gun returns just a little bit high, still works very, very well. The guns are also easy to rack. You know, you always get this amazing slide to frame fit with Atlas, the amazing barrel fit. Um, that's where the accuracy comes in. So this is the Nix. If you have to carry a high capacity gun and you need the best trigger and maximum amount of rounds in a medium size, the Nix 4.25 is your best option. 
see you guys on the range soon.